Hey guys, what's up? Today I have a hair tutorial for y'all. This is how I paint hair. This is my technique. What I am about to show you is how to paint the hair in this image. If you're interested, then please continue watching. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. I'll be more than glad to talk to you. So yeah, let's get started. So let's go to window to change my workspace. I like to change to painting because it's easier to navigate and it works better for my workflow. Next, we're going to select a brush. These are default Photoshop brushes. You should be able to find them in the folder dry meter brushes. I'm using the last one at the bottom. Create a new layer, select a color. You do not need any special settings for the brush, just use it as it is. We're going to paint from darkest to lightest, so choose a dark shade first. And then start painting the hair shape. Be sure to change sizes of the brush to paint different hair strokes. Once you're satisfied, create a new layer. I'm using the eyedropper tool to select a lighter color in the palette and slightly paint over it. Remember to draw different hair strokes. Continue drawing small hair strands all over because it'll look like actual hair later. Once you're done, it's time for the next step. Name the new layer Highlight. Again, use the eyedropper tool to select the lightest color. Even white will do because we're adding highlights. So this time, you'll just need to draw tiny hair strands. You can always go back to the first layer to draw more hair if needed. Now here's the fun part, dodge and burn. Make a new layer. Go to Image, Edit, Fill, 50% Gray, and click OK. Change the blending mode to Overlay. I like to dodge first, so I'm going to make my brush size small and paint over the light shades. 
It's just kind of like painting or drawing hair strands, except that you're just dodging. Do the same thing for burn, darken in between areas. Just go back and forth dodging and burning until it looks good and you're happy with your results. Here's the before and after using dodging and burning. So that's it you guys, it's pretty easy right? I hope you enjoy my videos and I hope my video helps you. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for notifications so you won't miss any updates from me. And I'll have new videos up every week. Thank you so much you guys, love ya!